Our muscles lie under our skin and help us make every single movement. They work in pairs. Here are some of our biggest and most important muscles. Can you now try and link the names of the muscles to the correct location on the body? Now you have completed the task, go back and check your answers. In PE, you are expected to know the names and locations of major muscles, so it's important you remember this information. To help make sure you do, why not try and teach someone you live with? The squat is a fundamental movement, not just in sport, but in our day-to-day -day lives. If you can squat, like little Larry here, you will be stronger, more flexible and less likely to get injured. Place these blocks on the floor, quite near the door, and my feet about 12 inches, 30 centimetres away from the door, nice and parallel, my back flat against the door, all the way down to my bum, and all I'm going to do is I'm going to squat down, keep my back and my bum pressed against the door, I'm going to pick up the blocks, and I'm going to stand up again. Uh, the first big muscle that we're going to engage or think about engaging when we do a squat are our gluteus maximus, our glutes, otherwise known as our bum. So all you're going to do is you're going to sit on the floor like me, sit nice and tall and you're going to clench your bum so that you come up off the floor a little bit. Do it again. Okay, you should feel the muscles really, really tensing. You won't be able to do it for very long, okay, because it's quite hard. Yeah. The next big muscle that you include in the squat is are your quadriceps. Those are these big muscles down the front of your legs. To engage this, to engage these, your quads, you just sit on the floor like this and all you're going to do is just slightly lift your heels off the floor, heels off the floor, and you should then feel your quadriceps engaging. The next big muscle that you engage when you are doing a squat is your hamstring okay these are about those, those big muscles that run all the way down the back of your thigh so to engage those and to feel what they feel like just sit like this with your back against the wall feet up and just pull your feet up towards your bum and you will feel your hamstrings engaging to be able to do it okay the final um group of muscles that you're going to engage um when you think about or you're going to think about engaging when you do your squat are your abdominals those are these muscles here they're on the very outside of your core so you're going to put your hands on these muscles and all you'll do to engage them is to just rock back like that and you should feel them tensing and going more solid that is your core or your abdominals engaging like that and all the way back up I'm going to use my duster as a pole. I'm going to place it on my arms, just about where my elbows are. I'm going to do this squat challenge. So the closer my feet are to the door, the harder it is. So I'm going to put them about there for now. Again, back flat against the wall, against the door and your bum. And I'm going to do as many as I possibly can. You are, I'm not. All the way down, all the way up. That's a bit easy. Bring your feet in, all the way down, all the way up. So you can move your feet a bit closer, all the way down, keep your heels on the floor, all the way up. Now my heels nearly came off the floor then, so I know that that's as close as I can get my feet to the door 
without my heels coming off the floor. All the way down, all the way up. Your challenge is to do as many of those as you can, as quickly as you can. <laughs> 